Well, with all the political conversations these days, it's awfully easy to conclude, for young folks especially, that that's all there is, talk. Right, but there are places on Delmarva where you can really see our great nation and touch it with your own hands. Charlie takes us to one in tonight's travels. It's just an old window in a wood frame shack, but who has more wealth than the one who gazes from it? That's what I think when we visit the Assateague Island National Seashore near Berlin. Because there it's profoundly clear that this barrier island belongs to all of us. Just as the great and mighty ocean belongs to all who live on the earth. This narrow strip of land managed by the National Park Service is here for each one of us to seek what we may find. To use a metal detector as set forth. What are you looking for? I belong to a metal detecting club. Uh-huh. Um, Shore Seekers Metal Detecting Club in, uh, for Delmarva Peninsula. The club tells me that it's legal on the state side from Labor Day through, through I'm sorry, from Memorial Day. What is it? From... From Labor Come on, you read them. You were here. Labor Day through Memorial Day, and yes. we wanted to make sure that that was a fact, and there is a metal detecting uh, rules and regulations. I got something special for, for Christmas. My wife bought me a sand scoop for metal detecting. You got him a sand scoop? Now, how did you know that was what he wanted? Well, because he told me. There is treasure here for all of us, for those who search these dunes for ancient coins, or those who come to seek the comfort of Mother Earth. This is the country that we own together. This is the land we sing about when we sing, this land is your land. And you could say that from this humble window with the Atlantic Ocean at your back, that you can see it all from sea to shining sea, the full promise of this great country. Which, like this strip of land along the ocean, belongs to all of us. Makes you feel right proud, don't it? At the Assateague Island National Seashore, this is Charles Paparella for WBOC News.